The events that I'm about to describe are going to sound incredible to most people. But I know they happened. I saw them happen. They happened to me. One night, not very long ago, my fiancé and I saw a meteor-like object flash through the sky and fall to Earth in the Arizona desert. I was the first one to go into the smoking pit where it landed. The only one to realize that this meteor was a spaceship. I looked into it. I alone knew that the beings it carried, formless, terrifying beings from outer space, planned to conquer the world. And so fiendishly, by entering into the bodies and minds of captured human beings. Wouldn't it be a fine trick if I weren't really John Putnam at all? But something from another world come here to give you a lot of false leads. What do you want? What are you doing? Let me see you as you really are. No, you're not Ellen. You've got Ellen's clothes, but you're not Ellen. Sandrock, Arizona, of a late evening in early spring. It's a nice town, knowing its past and sure of its future, as it makes ready for the night and the predictable morning. The desert blankets the earth, cooling, resting for the fight with tomorrow's sun. And in my house near the town, we are also sure of the future. So very sure. Hmm, 12 sharp. Trying to get rid of me? Because if you are, it won't do you any good. Well, I wouldn't want people to talk. <laughs> Let them, they do it anyway. You know, I think it must be my money that impresses you. What money? Well, I got a check today. Johnny, you sold another article. Uh -huh. Got enough to finish the outside of the house, all the comforts of home. Hmm. To think of the time I wasted living in the city. It's nice out here. Question is, would you keep this up if we were married? Of course not. As soon as I got your name on the marriage certificate, I wouldn't have to do it anymore. Hmm. Let's go see what the stars have to say. I already know your horoscope. You know who the stars say a man born under your sign should marry? No. Me. I'm a Scorpio, and a Scorpio always gets along well with a Sagittarius. Really? Uh -huh. What else do they say? Oh, uh, a Sagittarius is philosophical and very positive and has a, a blithe, happy-go-lucky manner. Would starve if someone didn't come along to make him a meal occasionally. And is quite helpless in certain situations. Look at my stars. Tell me 
if they say whether a Sagittarius could support a Scorpio. Starlight, star bright, first star I've seen tonight. I wish I may. I wish I might have the wish I wish tonight. Biggest. C can you see it? Yeah. Yeah, there it is. It's by the old Excelsior mine. <laughs> 